Hey all, Matt here with Bobcat Bonsai, and today we're going to open up a package from my friend Gav from over in England. He sent me so graciously. I always appreciate Gav and his packages that he sends me. Um, he always hides like great stuff in here. So let's get it opened up. Don't mind the tools over here, okay? So over there, we have stuff from my fence I'm working on building around my garden out there. Yes, it's taking me forever, I know. But, I'm working on it, and we're getting places. So, I'll take it. Um, this package says that it's fragile, so we gotta be real careful while we're opening it. I'm just gonna take some scissors here. And just cut on little ends. Sorry, I bumped you a little bit there. Let's take a look, see. Oh, what do we have inside here? Oh, nice. He got me some more seeds that I got over here. Some more paper bark maples, which is super exciting. Um, we'll actually go take a look at some of the seeds that Gab sent me. And then some more hornbeams, which is also awesome. So I'm super excited about that. I didn't know these were coming at all, which is super cool. What do we have here? Alright, that's cool. So this is a whole, a whole map of the loose area, which is really neat because now I can really grasp about the different parts of where Gav's from, which definitely, it's really cool to learn where each other are from. So that's super neat to get. Actually, my wife will really enjoy this too because she was born over in England. So she was there for a little while. Oh, what do we got here? We've got a letter. Let's pop this open. Oh, and stickers. Oh, we gotta love stickers. And we know exactly where uh, one of these stickers is gonna go. So let's just pop it up here on our background for when I do my videos. And we're gonna add him up here with the other tree mason brethren, Jonas from Bonsai Cornwall. So, there we go. Got Gav added up in there too. Let's check out the boys real quick. There we are. Looking good. Looking good. All right. So, Gav said, hey Matt, how's it going? Well, what can I say? I just have too many pots, so I thought I would share some with you. So I guess I know what's inside here now. It's good to see that you have had some success with the seeds that I sent last autumn. I have so many that I thought I would send you some more. Oh, also, I don't know how much you know about England or where I live in Sussex, so I thought you would enjoy a town map. Take care, buddy. Thanks, Gav, from now, now another Bonsai channel. That's awesome, Gav, and I really do appreciate it. But now let's check out these pots. Got to get through the paper. Make sure they made it over here nice and safely. Good news is, it is intact. I can feel it without even opening it yet. Oh. And Gav even pre-drilled the hole for me. So now I don't have to worry about that. Hole's drilled. It's ready to be used. That is awesome. I really like the, uh, the white glaze they put on this pot, Gav. That's super cool. And this little, uh, the little burn spot 
in the glaze it looks almost like a little piece of uh oh sorry i'm not showing you let me see here focus here not on my finger there so it almost looks as if you look real real closely you can see a little hole just right inside there it looks like a piece of iron or something blew out of the clay and just kind of left that marking but that is really neat that and then you've got like the random specks of blue right in here sorry it's hard to zoom in on the detail but these pots are really really nice really really nice little pots and these are made by a local potter uh over by gav so that's super neat as well let's make sure there's not anything else in here before i take the box down and there's not so whoa that came in really close it's been a little bit toasty here lately and this weekend is finally supposed to cool off which is going to be awesome because i can use a break from the heat um a little bit about me when I'm not doing bonsai or forging tools, I do work a full-time job. Um, it's pretty cool. I enjoy it. I get to travel around and install security systems, things like that. And um, I also officiate youth sports. So when it's really, really hot, I'm like, I get toasted super quick and I'm like man I don't want to be super hot so I'm happy it's finally dropping down a little bit there's clouds it looks like we're gonna get rain for the first time in forever I've been stuck watering the trees rather than being able to just rely on nature to rain them out but I said we we're gonna check on the trees so let's go check them out all right so first up we have the Norway maples and as we can see here we've got one that came through really strong then over here we have the English sycamores and I have three of these that are coming in really nicely so far. Um, right here we have the Acer Grissiums. Those ones haven't come in yet and that's all right. So a lot of times with these seeds because it's a lot harder shell it takes about two years for them to germinate. So that's where I'm at with those ones and where they've grown to. So let's head over to the other ones. You're going to like this. So right here is one of the English oaks and they're starting to open up. I have a mixture of English oaks and then just regular oak trees from around here and then weeds that popped up in between. But they're starting to open up. They definitely need more water again because they're drinking the water like crazy. I try to leave it so that they can reach their tap roots out the bottom. Um, some of them have done really strong in their reach. But yeah, like this one right here. That one reached all the way out already. And now it's hooked underneath. But that's where we're at as far as those go. This one's looking phenomenal though right now. There we go. So I'm really excited about that one. We gotta make sure we keep that one taken care of like a little baby. All right, so hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you enjoyed my content, you should subscribe to my channel. And if you really, really enjoy my content, you should hit the bell notifications so you get notified every time I release a new video. Thank you.